Hello beautiful people, it is Sephiria Lovery here. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a Winn-Dixie grocery haul. You are looking at $99 worth of grocery. I did um, stay under my $100 budget here today. Mostly um, lots of back to school snack items and a few items uh, for dinner. So let me go ahead and let you know what I got and let you know about the prices. So the Butterball butter Ground Turkey was priced at two for six dollars. I picked up two of them. And this is the 85% lean, 15% fat, all natural ground turkey. One pound of it. And I think it paired nicely with the sale over here on the Barilla Pasta which was on sale for four for five dollars so I just picked up two of the spaghetti and then two of the tri-color rotini picked up one box of the screaming Sicilian pizza this is the holy pepperoni variety and you can see it says piles of pepperoni it do has um, lots of um, pepperoni on this particular pizza and then it was priced at $5.99 I use one of these coupons that I got from going to this company's website and just asking them to send me coupons. So they sent me two of them. I used one today for a dollar off, making it $4.99, which was a great price for a one pound pizza. Also picked up a container of Eglin's Best Grade A Large Eggs. This was priced at $3. And then I had a 50 cents off of one coupon. Picked up two of the Deli Fresh Oven Roasted uh, Lunch Meat. These are priced at two for $6. Picked up this three pack of Sargento Snack Breaks or Balance Breaks on sale for $3.79 and I had a 75 cents off coupon for the one so that made each little pack about one dollar a piece not bad to put in your work bag for lunch or to give to your child for a school snack picked up one package of the Winn-Dixie brand of taco seasoning and I encourage you to pay attention to all of the coupons that print out for you at the register as well as going ahead and printing out all of your coupons from the red box machine at the front of the store I use this coupon that I got from the cash register it was 15 cents off the taco seasoning and so I picked that up today didn't buy much of the produce today I just stuck with um, the cabbage here that I found for 69 cents for the head and then I got two uh, cucumbers for 69 cents each and then I also got a bag of yellow potatoes they were $3.99 this is a five pound bag Let me turn them over I find that they last a little bit longer than the regular Idaho russet potatoes so I wanted to pick these up and give them a try Speaking of coupons printing out from the red box machine at the front of the store, I got a coupon for a dollar off four of the rice pasta sides or rice sides or rice or pasta sides from Nor, excuse me. Uh, so I picked up four of those. You get a dollar off four. These were priced at one dollar and thirty nine cents. So I got at least one package for thirty nine cents. And then I also got a coupon for um, the smart water it was completely free I think that when Dixie is starting to piggyback off of Publix as their main competitor so they are issuing out coupons for free items to get you to try them and hopefully like them so that you can buy more in the future so they had several different flavors of this smart water so I just picked up the strawberry blackberry they also had a pineapple kiwi and they had a cucumber lime and one other flavor that I didn't particularly like so I just picked up this one and the regular price for this water is one dollar and seventy nine cents so to get it for completely free was really really great for me so on to the not so healthy food I did pick up three packs of the Nabisco cookies they were on sale for 
buy two get one free and so of course I wanted to pick the cheapest packages that I can find so the smaller packages in the back these little minis and the Oreo thins were priced at $2.99 and then I found a clearance pack of these cookies left over from the 4th of July I would imagine these were priced at $3.69 the last package left I picked it up now the bigger packages cost anywhere from four dollars and nineteen cents up to five dollars and sixty nine cents so I couldn't really bring myself to pay that so I just went ahead and went with the cheapest packages and I also had one paper coupon for seventy five cents off of two so moving on to more junk food and more um, five dollar deals these were all five dollar deals so the packages of the Paw Patrol a little gummy snacks you get 10 in the pack. They were priced at two for five dollars, so I picked up two of those. The Rice Krispie treats were priced at three for five dollars, so I picked up those. You get eight in each box. And then these little muffins over here were buy one get one free for four ninety nine for the one, and then the other one was free. So two fifty a box, two for five dollars. My son is obsessed with these muffins, so I just went ahead and picked him up four boxes this time instead of my regular two. More snack items here and more fabulous coupons from the red box at the front of the store. So the Winn-Dixie variety pack of chips over there, you get 18 small little bags. They were already on sale for $5.99 and then I got a $3 coupon from the red box machine up at the front of the store. So that made the entire bag of chips $2.99. Excellent price for 18 bags of chips. And I can conveniently put those in my son's book bag for his little snack for school or give him a snack after school. The Lay's kettle chips were on sale for two for six dollars. So I picked up two of those. I picked up two eight packs of the Gatorade for $6.49 each and then I had a two dollar off coupon from the red box machine two dollars off two packages from the red box machine at the front of the store when Dixie so it made them kind of like two for ten dollars which is not bad and then lastly just a couple of household products I'm really starting to get into the Win Dixie brand of products also known as SE Grocers, so Southeastern Grocers is their parent company. And they're putting out some pretty nice uh, store brand products here. These are paper plates. You get 20 paper plates in the pack, and these are the rather large size here. And you, um, I got these for two for five dollars, so not bad on those. This saves me a ton of time after work instead of washing a bunch of dishes I can just use these and of course you know Clorox wipes are still hard to come by so I managed to find these at the front of the store on a display for $4.99 and you get 80 wipes in there I thought it was a pretty good deal kills 99.9% .9 of the germs it has a lemon scent and of course it doesn't really compare to Lysol but I feel like some wipes are better than none, so I just picked these up. Here is a quick little rundown of my receipt. Let's take a look at my coupons that came off. There's a bunch of my Red box coupons there coming off at the top. You can see I got the free smart water. And I got a bonus coupon, $5 off $70 in grocery. Super excited that that coupon printed for me because last time I didn't print it and I wasn't able to use it. And then you can see some of the other coupons that I had with me. I got a total of 41 items. And my total says 100 there because I went ahead and donated the 86, 86 cents that was left from my total. I went ahead and donated that to charity. And then you can see here that I had almost a 
total savings of $53 there. And I had only $3 in coupons. So they just counted the coupons that I presented to them. They didn't count the Winn-Dixie store coupons in that total. Then you can see I have six times the points on my next purchase, which I may use towards the store credit that I have. I have $27.15 in store credit. So what I might do next week is go ahead and come and uh, use that $27 credit and then use this six times the points on that. Showing some appreciation for you for watching my Winn-Dixie couponing video. Please remember to continue to support my channel by watching the videos, clicking on like, subscribing to my channel, sharing my video content with your friends and family, and I will see you guys on my next Winn-Dixie Grocery Haul. Thank you so much.